All right, all right. This one is going to be fun. <laughs> I have a customer that said he wanted one of these new 29s. Now, I said, I've been out of the game for a while, and we just came back, so I haven't really seen this one yet. And everybody that's talking to me about it, some guys say, like, it, some guys say it's junk. I don't know. So, but he doesn't want just this. He wants, he wants a 409 atized. So, this is what we're going to do. Um, he's getting a swing kit. He's getting one of our Super Duty 2 boards that we're going to make it PEP about 100 if I could pull it off. Test going on, huh? And then, uh. Right now, out of the box, I, I already tell you some issues that I don't like. They're put together a little sloppily. Um, I had to pull the center for the volume out a little bit because when you turned it up and down, it was dragging on your squelch. So if you guys buy a new one of these, when you get it out of the box, just make sure that these don't drag each other, the duels, up and down. If they're pushed in too hard against each other, when you turn this one, it'll grab this one. And it, that's what it was doing over here. I'm turning the volume up, turning the squelch up at the same time. So we, we just pull that out if that happens. Um, let's see how it's doing now. I like the features. I like having this uh, frequency display. That's that's pretty nice. Um, but once again, it's it's a brand new unit, so we're, we're going to figure out. I, I've had a couple guys tell me don't play with it. Well, I think what we're going to do is not play with this part of the radio. But everything from what I've seen from... It's brazier here back is all old school 29. So I'm going to second base with this one. And we're going to make it smile. Um, it's getting a board. Let's see what it's doing out of the box. There's a three watt dead key out of the box. But here, frequency 1753. Now on AM, no, it doesn't make no, never mind, hardly, but that should be 50. Um, uh, let me turn my gain up. Stock right out of the box on a slug PEP meter. Uh, uh, it's thresholding at about 15 PEP, and of course it's pulling back. Um, the meter, I don't know about this meter, now it says RF, but I'm not seeing any forward anything there. Oh, I'm on calibrate, that's why. Let's see, SRF. SWRL. There we go. There we go. There it is. Learn how to use the radio. Okay, so now I do like that. I do like this meter. That's sweet. And apparently you can change these colors. I guess it's got like five different colors. It's one of those things where I got, hey, dummy, sit down and read the book. I'm sure somebody's sitting there going, just do this. This is the first time I've seen a freaking radio. So put your pants back on and sit down. All right, here we go. So that's what we're going to do. That's what it's doing now. Um, it's off frequency. Um, it's got its cojones clipped. So... It's Cajonis Clip. <laughs> so here we go. Um, this is going to be a wild ride, boys and girls. I'm either going to make a really, really, really cool-ass radio or, um, you know, sometimes poo-poo happens. No, I'm kidding. This is going to be a nice one. Um, keep your eyes on it. I promise you, when, when I pull this one off, this is going to be one of the baddest 29s, the new ones that's ever walked the face of this planet. I promise you. All right. The owner knows what he's getting. His page is going up today. This is the virgin. Uh, when we're done, you're going to see the bitch. Seven threes.